What's going on guys, it's Jokerist here bringing some more of our Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battles. Let's go ahead and uh, get into this some, I guess. We have the same team that we had on Tuesday. So we got Galarian Moltres, uh, Comfy, Chapu Fini, Raichu, Incineroar, and Metagross. Uh, if you guys want to know the move sets, it will be in the description below. So go ahead and check that out if you are interested. Uh, let's see who decides the rules here. Looks like he's gonna decide the rules. Two to six, no restrictions. Great. Now let's see if I can remember to pick all six Pokemon. <laughs> Because I have this very weird problem of only picking four. Alright. Looks like he has the Aegislash, Tyranitar, Charizard, Snorlax, Urshifu, and Melmetal. So. Let's see. Looks like he has a double weakness to fire, but I don't think he'll start out with one of them. Um, I'm thinking he'll probably start out with Tyranitar, try to get the Sandstorm up and stuff, so we'll go ahead and pick Tapu Fini. Um, I don't know what else he would even bring. So I guess we'll bring Metagross. Because the only thing I really have to worry about there is Charizard. But then Tapu Fini will take care of that. So I think... I think we're... We picked Solid, but I don't know. Tyranitar and Charizard. Which means my Metagross is in danger. <laughs> okay. So. I think we just withdraw Metagross. And send in Incineroar because that fire attack is definitely coming. I'm gonna be real sad if that Tyranitar wants any part of this though. Dynamaxing right off jump? That's interesting. Alright, there's the Charizard. Alright, so there's that fire I predicted. How do you avoid muddy water? It's like surf. Dragon dance. I didn't see that coming. This is gonna get saucy fast. Okay, we're just gonna go for another muddy water. And you don't really have anything for this matchup.
Nice. Of course it was a crit. Why would it not be a crit? Okay, what do we do? What do we do? I think we just send out Moltres now. Because I think that's the only other safe one. I think. Just keep muddy water in it. I know this isn't very effective, but as long as we go first. Man, I needed Tapu Fini to live. We are definitely losing here. I was hoping there'd be a flinch, but I guess it didn't matter because I was the slower one. I got nothing left. Just bolt switch. And yeah. Thank you, Focus Ash. Because that was going to end bad. Oh, it's still ending bad. Still ending bad. Okay. Well, now that Charizard is gone, Metagross can come out, and uh, I think we'll be okay. Oh my gosh! Yeah, this this is a wrap, guys. Definitely a wrap. To the Angel Slash now. Okay. Let's see what we got. Of course, Earthquake does affect it. I figured if it was flying, it wouldn't bother it, right? Not how things work, apparently. This is gonna hurt. Finally got rid of the Tyranitar. I'm gonna get rid of the Sandstorm. That's nice, that's nice. We are, are they are still up to Pokemon though, so that's not nice. I think, I think, I think this is going to be the best play. We're going to go ahead and Dynamax our Metagross because he will have um, was it Max Quake or something. And 
it'll take care of, like it'll basically get rid of Earthquake and replace it with a uh, move that only hits one Pokemon, which in turn will save our Comfy. I wish that Draining Kiss did more than what it did. Hoping that did more. All right. Well, this is it. Oh, I forgot Raichu is still alive. That one HP confused me. It's a wrap. Uh, looks like we have enough time to squeeze in another one. So we'll go ahead and do one more. See if we can win. Uh, good job, Drizzle. I do not want your lead card, though. We are against Amen. All right, let's see what he's bringing. Okay, he's got Cinderace, uh, Full Corona, Gavantula, Rotom. Wow, I wish I had a grass type. Um, so he's got a lot of ground weakness, it looks like. Um,. I think Metagross is the only one on the ground, but then he's also Steel, so that would make him weak to all of the fire, so really that's not helpful. Um, I think we're going to start out with Moltres, and Tapu Fini maybe? I don't know how well this is going to go, guys. He, he has a lot of the same types, which is kind of beneficial for us. But then, like, his counter types that he has kind of tops out Tapu Fini. So, I don't know how well this is going to go. Of course, we see these two right up front. The two I really didn't want to see first.
uh, which I had a fire type on this Moltres. I don't know what I was thinking. We're going to go ahead and swap out our Tapu Fini because we're going to need it for later. Absorb a Rotom? Oh, weakness policy. That's smart. That seems over the top. <laughs> let's, uh, let's try to get a flinch. Hopefully, I still go faster, but I don't. I don't think so. Okay, here comes the Dynamax. Probably on Rotom also. That, that road time is just a monster. I'm getting swept. Flinch? No flinch? Alright, goodbye, Incineroar. Whoa, we lived? Alright, maybe this ain't over yet. I mean, it's gonna be a tough battle, but at least it's not over. And we got the burn, look at that. Let's uh, just keep trying for this flinch. Maybe we can get it. Do Dynamax Pokemon even flinch? I don't even know. Okay, there goes Moltres. And here goes Incineroar. Alright, perfect. Not really. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. I think... All we got is Comfy and Metagross. Because if we send out Top of Finny, it's literally just getting swept. And Raichu's a soft boy, so. That's definitely problems. Um, we'll just keep Draining Kiss. And. We'll go ahead and Dynamax also and hit this Max Quake on Rotom and see what that does. But I don't know. I feel like this is going to be bad. That gazer hurts. Alright. 
Yo, that's a thing? Oh my god. Well, this is happening now. I am not good at this game. I never once claimed to be good at this game. Um, we're just going to call mine, because if we can get one set, at least we should be able to try and pull this back around. I was just kidding, guys. You know, thunderbolts and stuff. Yeah. Oh, just pick the next Pokemon to wipe me with. There is no no comeback for this. Absolutely nothing. The road time just does so much. Well, hopefully we can get rid of road time after this one as long as we go first. But I, I don't think uh, Tapu Fini went before road time. Raichu should be fine, but I don't think Raichu does enough damage. Yeah, it was nothing. I think we're really gonna make a difference here but we're gonna go ahead and volt tackle the Vulcanian and just muddy water and see what we get I should have assumed it was the bureau water absorb that's great Alright, that still wasn't enough to say Cinderace though, so... Oh, that's tough. We do have our berry popping off though. Weaky berry. So... Um... 
I think we're gonna have to dazzling clean from here on. Though. Um. Yeah, I think that's what. I think we go for another muddy water. Get rid of the Volcarona. Okay, tough. Didn't even kill him. Alright, let's see. Hopefully this um, Dazzling Gleam is enough to finish off the Volcarona. Uh, I guess now it doesn't matter because we lost. Alright, that's it guys. We're going to end this on two losses in a row. Um, go ahead, come back next week. We will have a brand new team. Let me know if you guys are enjoying this though in the comment section below. And remember, um, the team layout will be in the description also, just in case you guys want to play around with the same team. Maybe you guys are luckier than I am. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.